Here we are in Huahini checking out the sacred blue-eyed eels as they have the little lunchtime snack. I think culture is like the reason why we travel. You want to experience how people live their life, learn about their history, learn about what's important to them, chat to locals. Uh, that's huge for travel. I can't imagine not seeking those experiences when you go on a, on a trip. So in the island of Huahini, you can discover these amazing sacred sites. They're called the Mare. They're still actually continuing to discover them today. Um, and it's such a cool experience to be walking through these amazing hundreds year old sites um, with your local guide who's telling you all about the history of it. For us, it's still right there, it's still in the bush. We just have to uncover a bit of the nature and we're going to find sites such as this one. So it's very interesting to maintain it, preserve it and teach kids where they're from. After all, people go to Easter Island for one reason, see the giants. Here we have the ancestors of those giants in Easter Island because these people from here moved to Easter Island, moved to Hawaii, moved to New Zealand. So this is a very big hub for the Polynesian society. This is why we're trying to preserve it. These sites help people know where they came from and I think that's a really important part and they're continuing to still discover more today and continuing to preserve them. Checking out a pearl farm. So as a Tahitian, it's very important for us to have a Tahitian black pearl. We all have one somewhere in our closet because it's part of our culture. So how long does it normally take to make a pearl? Minimum 18 months before we actually get um, a pearl. Got a pearl and a certificate from the smallest pearl farm in French Polynesia. So a really cool experience is to see how a traditional perio, which is a, a sarong, is made. And so we met a, a local guy named Frank. Uh, he's been living on the island of Wahini for a long time. Bugs. So this side is the national flower. Alo perio, it's handmade painting. Frank literally you know, has his acrylic paints and this blank canvas and he paints this perio, sets it out to dry and then you can you know, buy it at the end. He can custom create it for you. It's really cool to see him make it. It looks like the easiest thing in the world, but I'm sure it's quite difficult. And everyone in the islands of Tahiti is wearing perios. You're not going to find anyone who doesn't have one, so it's really cool to see how it's made. I'm here on Bird Island, which has nine species of birds, and you can get right up close to them, just like this one named Lily. She's pretty darn cute. So as a U.S. Tour Operator Association member like Go Away, we know Tahiti inside and out. So you're going to get an experience that's tailor-made for you with fantastic operators, great value, and that's really hard to get on your own.